Yeah, I just want to say shout out to the Raiders. Um, only Raiders fans that I really talked to would be Pistol. He was the one that got me to doing this in the first place back in 2013. And then uh, Ash Raider. Congratulations to you guys. I know I do a lot of shit talking on uh, not so much Instagram, more Facebook, but I'm not really cool with those guys. I just like shit talking. Uh, to them, fuck the Raiders still when it's all said and done. But congratulations to you guys. I even said you guys were going to beat us, so I'm not mad. If we had Austin Eckler, I would have picked us, but we don't. He's the only reason why we had a running game. Justin Jackson was on again, off again. Uh, Justin Kelly, he had a good first game, and that's the only game he impressed me with. Uh, Mike Williams and Keenan Allen show up when they want to. I feel bad for Justin Herbert because he's going to probably going to end up winning like Rookie of the Year. And I don't know if you can be a possible MVP candidate with only one win on your resume, maybe two, but having three to fucking four touchdown games. Um, but we don't deserve the win if you can't try. It's always next man up. I don't care if Keenan Allen's hurt. I don't care if Joey Bosa's out. I don't care who is out. I care is, is next man up. That's what a good team does, and this team does not like to do that. If you can't be next man up, you don't belong in the lead. And our team right now really is trash. Uh, I like to see our coaches go, all of them. I like to see the play callers go, all of them. I like to see everybody fresh blood. And if Tom Telesco can't do that, I like to see him go too. It's, it's enough enough with this nonsense. I think the only game we're going to win this year until we get Austin Eckler back is going to be the Jets. And that's a maybe. I'm hoping to see the Cowboys lose this game. And right now they are winning for some reason with a fourth string quarterback. And I can watch every single one of my teams win a championship this year and then the Chargers will somehow ruin it for me. That's just how, even though the Angels were my first team, the Chargers are my favorite team and they can just ruin shit like that for me. But anyway, like I said, congratulations to Ass Raiders and Pistol. They're the only Raiders fans that I'm cool with. Um, still fuck the Raiders. It's all said then. Fuck the Broncos. Fuck the Chiefs. I was really hoping the Chiefs would lose. Fuck the Cowboys. Um, I was really hoping the Panthers would have won that game. 67-yard field goal wasn't going to happen. Yeah, I, I guess I talked to Raider Cousin for a second today. I don't really know him. I mean, I ain't really, like I said, I talked to uh, a few Raiders fans on Facebook, but I'm not cool with them. That's more well, these are shit talking pages because it's like the Battle of LA. It's between Raiders fans, Charger fans, and Rams fans. But it's always the same shit usually. Raiders fans will talk about rings. I'll be like, that's like 40 year history. None of you guys are allowed to see them. Like if Rams fans say anything, we just bring up the whole three points that you guys scored at the Super Bowl nonsense. You had the worst scoring in any Super Bowl history. But anyway, this video is going on a little too long. And I know it's only third quarter for the game, but the Chargers ain't going to win. Even if we make a comeback, we're going to somehow like throw an interception or some bullshit at the end. I'm out.